gets in. What'll he do? The goalie gets to the bench. Still, there's time on this delayed call. He drives toward the slot. They score! Wow, that's getting on the board fast. Kessel's stick was in a ready position, and he one time to pass the goalie. The passer recognizes that he's got to get the puck up in the air, but he displays sweet hands as it goes just over the stick and lands flat on the ice. Laid on to Bozak. Puck settled down by Franson. Right near the line. Can he keep it going? Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. The goalie he makes himself look. In on the two-on-two. -two. Can they get reinforcements here? To Gardner. Boston survived it. Back even. Wonderful save with a pad. Big pad save. So up the wing with it now. Two on one opportunity. He's into the slot. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. Herford Gardner into the attacking end. Slides into the point. Blocked. Again. Oh, that puck slowed up and just missed the side of the net. Just why? What a scoring opportunity. He had six foot of net to look at. He missed every bit of it. That's two periods in the books. Carried through center ice. Oh, good chance here. He's got a wonderful centering pass. To Kelly. To side. Scooped up by Karan. Out in front. Wrist shot. They score! And they've tied the game up. You get to this high scoring area, a wrist shot is a great choice. Anderson's made himself a little smaller here. It's opened up some room over his stick side shoulder. It is a rare power play that is a four against three, but that's what we have right now, and it begins. Toronto's got it. Oh, here's a wrister. He scores! Game over. Overtime winning goal. And the game is over. Overtime is an extra slice of pie. Tasted pretty good to everybody watching tonight, except the loser. I'd prefer banana cream, Doc. <laughs>